G'day, g'day. It's Nick here and welcome to episode nine, our second last episode in our series on Australia's 10 most invasive species. Now we've talked about a fair few critters so far. We've talked about plants, predators, herbivores, but in this episode, we've got the second most invasive species in the country and something that I think the vast majority of you guys will never have heard about. So stick around. Number two in our list of most invasive species is not an animal, it's not a plant, it's actually a fungus. It's called Phytophthora. And one of the things that spread it is number three, feral pigs have the ability to spread this stuff around. But Phytophthora is a fungus that originated in the United States 200 years ago. Since then, it's now found in over 70 countries. And what this fungus does is infect the root systems of all kinds of plants around the world. Basically, it causes these root systems to rot, means that they can't absorb nutrients, and entire plant communities basically die off. Entire forests can die back. Now, here in Australia, some of the plants that are particularly susceptible to Phytophthora are trees like Jarrah, but also plants like Grevilleas, Banksias, things like this. So we can be have forests that might look green when we walk in, but all this medium story, the Grevilleas, the Banksias, things like this, have died off from Phytophthora. And it doesn't just affect those plants, we've got a whole series of small animals, birds, marsupials, like honey possums, that need those plants to live off. They've evolved for millions of years, living on the nectar of these particular species. So it poses a risk to entire ecosystems, even though it's not something you can walk around the bush and see. Perhaps the scariest thing about this Phytophthora fungus isn't the fact that pigs are able to spread it around, it's the fact that well-meaning people are able to spread it around. The soil on your boots or the soil on the wheels of your car is enough to spread this fungus from one forest to infect a whole other forest somewhere else and there is no known cure. Despite the fact that Phytophthora is an agricultural pest, it infects crops and trees worth millions of dollars all around the world. So we haven't been able to get rid of it from ecosystems here in Australia if the money thrown by the agricultural community hasn't gotten rid of it. Because of this, unfortunately today, there's no known cure. It's going to get worse, but Phytophthora impacts 236 native Australian species. So there you have it, guys. Turns out the second most invasive species in the country is not a predator. It's not even an animal or a plant, but a fungus, Phytophthora. So I bet about the vast majority of you guys wouldn't have seen that coming. I certainly didn't before I started looking into this video, but there it is, second most invasive species in the country. And that just leaves one more episode. Next week, we will talk about the single most invasive species in the whole of Australia in terms of how many threatened species it impacts. So stick around, guys. It's been a great nine weeks. There's one left, so I'll see you next week. But between now and then, check back on our other uh, top 10. But I'll see you next week. Have a good one and take care.